Hey everybody, Chris here, welcome you back to another Proto Tech Tip, and this week we're going to cover a basic but very important topic, deciding between sheet metal fabrication and CNC machining when prototyping a custom part or enclosure. So let's just get right into it. So when it comes to prototyping a custom part or enclosure, selecting the right manufacturing process can make all the difference for your project. Two of the most popular methods, sheet metal fabrication and CNC machining, each offer distinct advantages depending on your specific requirements. At Protocase and Protospace MFG, we can custom manufacture your part or enclosure using either method in just two to three days. But you might be wondering when to choose sheet metal fabrication and when to go with CNC machining. Well, that's the goal of this video, to help you figure that out. Sheet metal fabrication involves shaping thin sheets of metal by cutting, bending, and assembling, while CNC, short for Computer Numerical Control, machining uses software-driven tools to cut material from a solid block. To choose the right method, you'll want to look at your project through the lens of a few factors. The first and probably most important consideration is design complexity. If your prototype is a simple flat design or has angular shapes, then sheet metal fabrication is going to be the way to go. It's ideal for box-like enclosures, chassis and housings with bendable or folded structures. Meanwhile, if it's highly detailed, has intricate geometries and blind features, then you should be going with CNC machining. For example, if your enclosure needs tight tolerances or integrated features like threads, grooves, then sheet metal fabrication might not be the right fit. Next up, let's talk about durability and strength. Sheet metal fabrication produces strong and durable parts and enclosures, ideal for applications requiring resilience. While CNC machining is equally capable of producing strong prototypes with the added advantage of tighter tolerances and better surface finishes. While strong, sheet metal enclosures may not be as robust as solid machined enclosures for high impact applications. Therefore, machined enclosures are better suited for harsher environments like aerospace applications. They also provide much better protection against moisture and water, those external elements that you want to watch out for. Next, when it comes to integrated features, sheet metal fabrication makes it easy to add perforations, vents, or access panels, making it ideal for enclosures that need ventilation cutouts or lightweight designs with fasteners, latches, or hinged panels. On the other hand, machined enclosures are great for high precision parts and enclosures where everything is part of a single structure, with built-in heat sinks and gaskets or complex pockets for electronics. Now we do understand that many of you work with tight deadlines, so you might be wondering about the speed of the manufacturing. Sure, machining generally takes a bit longer because of the programming setup and all of the details that are involved. But here's the good news. Thanks to high velocity mass customization, or HVMC as we like to call it, we offer lead times of just two to three days for fully finished custom parts or enclosures. Whether you choose sheet metal fabrication or CNC machining, we'll manufacture your custom parts in just two to three days. But do note that the complexity level of CNC machining can really impact lead times. So we've put together a guide that breaks down the different complexity levels in our machining processes. You can find the download link for that guide in the description below. Now before wrapping up this video, I want to quickly chat about the material choices that we offer here at Protocase and Protospace MFG. For sheet metal fabrication, our stock includes steel, galvanil, stainless steel, aluminum, copper, and perforated sheet metal. Meanwhile, we stock aluminum, cold rolled steel, and stainless steel, as well as plastics such as Delrin, acetyl, UHMW, acrylic, and polycarbonate for CNC machining. So to conclude, the choice between sheet metal fabrication and CNC machining ultimately depends on the specific requirements of your custom part or enclosure prototype. If your enclosure is primarily flat, folded, or modular, go with sheet metal fabrication. If your prototype needs precision, tight tolerances, or is a solid block, well then go with CNC machining. So if you're looking for more design advice on this topic, feel free to reach out to our team. Just head to the contact page on either of our websites, and we'll drop the links to those websites in the description below. And that's a wrap for this week's Pro Tech Tip. I hope you found it helpful, and if you did, please don't forget to hit subscribe for more tech tips coming your way every Tuesday. Until next time, take care.